We are digging deeper as the Miami Valley is hit with a major loss today. Terra Data has announced it is relocating its headquarters from Austin Landing to San Diego by the end of the year. Officials say this means Miami Township is set to lose more than 300 jobs. Two News reporter Kristen Esco live outside Terra Data headquarters with more on this. Mark, company employees I spoke with today say this news was not unexpected at all. They say they've heard rumors about this for a while now. Now, many employees are faced with a decision either relocate with their position or stay here and find a job elsewhere. It was an announcement that some Teradata employees say wasn't a surprise. One tells me it was announced at a company wide meeting this morning that Teradata will relocate its headquarters to San Diego, moving many jobs there and some to Atlanta. One employee tells me smaller meetings were held after the large meeting where workers learned their position's fate. It's a very sad day that we're losing this legacy company that was part of NCR that got its start here in Dayton. Phil Parker, president and CEO of the Dayton Area Chamber of Commerce, says communication between Teradata and local organizations was strong when it first started about a decade ago. The data technology company is a spin-off of NCR which moved its headquarters and 1,300 jobs to Atlanta back in 2009. Parker says in recent years, communication between groups like his and the company declined. That's been a, a real uh, challenge, I think, for a lot of us to be able to make our best feelings known about how much we wanted to keep Teradata and how important they were to this community. Teradata says the move to San Diego is most efficient for the company long term. One worker says employees were allowed to take the rest of the day off after this morning's meetings. Obviously, I'm, I'm disappointed uh, in their decision. I think that they're making the wrong decision. State Representative Naraj Antani, who spoke with us by Skype from Columbus, tells me he's been in touch with a junior level executive from the company. But he says his attempts to reach senior level executives who aren't based in Dayton have been unsuccessful. And now Representative Antoni tells me he's trying to set up a meeting with the CEO of Teradata and other state officials to try to get Teradata to stay here in Ohio. We'll have more on those efforts and what other organizations are doing to take action coming up at 5. For now, we're live in Miami Township. Kristen Escow, 2 News, working for you.